Hello everybody, this is Nerf Gun Reviewer. Hold on a second. This is Nerf Gun Reviewer 331 here today. Today's update video, I'm going to be talking about a lot of things. Recently, I have been selling a little bit of my airsoft stuff. It was, uh, on, like, slash, uh, taking apart. This, is, this used to be an M14. It was an AEG. I took it apart so I can gut it and take the parts and use it for something else. What is this? Oh, that's something else. The... The AEG wasn't working. I figured out why. It's because one of these wires that connects to the actual mechanism that shoots at the BBs, fried. It's completely shot. So I have to get a soldering gun at some point and fix it. Either that or get another gearbox. The point with this uh, M14 gearbox, it's a plastic gearbox, but I want to put it into an M4 or put it into a long shot, a Nerf long shot that either is not working or it is working, but I just don't have a use for it. I'm thinking about putting it into something I, that doesn't work. Right around this time, it starts crapping out. Um, I'm gonna take a, I'm gonna take a risk. Also, my GoPro's been. Pretty much dying on me very recently. It will stop recording and it will freeze or do something, and it's getting it's getting really annoying. On a bright side, my Alpha Trooper, which I tried modifying, I thought I screwed up and left it alone for like many years. My friend Michael picked it up, shook it a couple of times. I think flipped it upside down and started shooting it upside down. Someone made it work. I fired a couple of Nerf bullets and it made it work. I'm like, how did you do that? That this this gun's been broken. I, this has been claimed broken for years because I modified it and I thought I screwed up on it. <clears throat> so now it works really well with darts and it w works really well with clips. Happy. It was just a basic AR removal and I'm very happy. As far as uh, things go, I also took apart a Range Master, which is a Busby gun. This is what it looks... Well, this is part of what the shell looks like. It's a bolt action... It's kind of like the Snipe from uh, Air Warriors, uh, but the Busby Air Warriors uh, uh, genre, brand, whatever... Except this is the non-ultra version. This is like the basic, uh, you just pull it back up and down. <laughs> you basically pump up the air tank that's inside this thing to make it shoot. And, um, yeah, I took, I took out the main component of that. Put a pump that I got from Panther from Air Zone Warriors, or Air Zone Guns from Toys R Us. I put the pump in there, and I don't really have pictures or any videos to explain what I did. I'm trying to explain it as best as I can. I'm trying to take out the air, air restrictor out of that, and basically turn it into some sort of like, like advanced warfare where the, where the gauntlet, where the grenade launcher pops out and shoots something, or maybe like an Assassin's Creed hidden blade, only it's a hidden gun. Right around this, and it's not crapping out. Oh, okay, I'm good, good. Uh, as far as things go, as far as jobs and money goes, I currently am broke. I'm trying to save up for a PS4, and it's not working very well. But at the same time, I still need to make these videos because I need to keep you guys up to date. I don't want to lose my YouTube uh, fan base, and I, I'm really afraid of that, really. If I lose the fan base, I lose. I just I don't think I can move on from from there on then. I'm not, I'm not trying to make an ultimatum, I'm not trying to make a, a guilt trip of any kind, I'm just trying to prepare myself for something that may, they may or may not happen in the future, like such as losing a fan base. Uh, I have, I have gotten a Dremel in the past, low, high, this is a Dremel 7700, this thing, it's just a basic Dremel I got from hardware store for about 34 35 bucks and I'm either gonna upgrade to a better Dremel or get a um, more 
Rotator, or Rotator, Rotator, I can't pronounce it. It's, I'm trying to get more drill bits and more saw blades to add to that so I can have more chances to cut, um, like Nerf guns, glue them together. That's the whole, that's my whole plan, but that's not going to happen anytime soon. It's just something I want to plan for. As far as, um, Nerf Wars go, I am trying to hook up uh, myself and a few other friends to do Nerf Wars. Everyone's just so freaking busy. My friend Michael's going away to college. My friend Julian is going to start is going to be starting college pretty pretty soon, I think. My friend Aaron is going to be busy at work, so I got to find other ways to make Nerf Wars happen. And at the same time, trying to make it work with everybody else's schedule, which I think is completely impossible. Uh, as far as personal life goes, personal life is, uh, some days are good, some days are bad. My beard is fully grown. This is like, the, this is like the biggest I've seen it in years, or ever actually. I'm, pl I'm continuing to grow this as much as I can. This is just a random topic I like to talk about, but anyway. Uh, still doing vaping, trying to quit. What else? Um, uh, there is, there's, um, I tried modifying a strong arm. I like the paint, I like the paint color. It's green and orange. It, I really like it. What, how the paint, the paint job went, the modifying part didn't go very well. And I kind of screwed up on on the instructions I didn't follow the instructions correctly or I just got too bored and said oh yeah I think I know how it works and I get and I just screw up completely so now I got I got to practice I got to practice myself to look at the instructions and watch the instructions multiple times and then and then somehow get an idea or just modify it as I'm watching the video like pause modify pause modify whatever uh, what else? And not to mention, I got one, two, three. I got three or four Nerf gun reviews. I gotta, I gotta eventually start up. Part of, part of me is what part of me what part of what my thinking goes is that if if I have. I have four Nerf guns that I need to review. Maybe three, actually. I have the Blazing Bow, I have the Roto Fury, and I have the Modulus. I have not reviewed any three of those yet. Although I have tried to review them in the past, but this piece of crap keeps, uh, like, pausing and, like, screwing up my recording. So I am trying to either uh, spend my time wisely to record videos at the same time not trying to get pissed off because of this stupid camera I'm not saying GoPro cameras are bad I'm just saying sometimes they can be a little finicky um what else as far as my life goes it's pretty boring I get up I eat I sleep repeat cycle I really have nothing going on and I'm trying to think of ways I can make make some money not from YouTube not from anything else I just need something to keep me entertained or at least something that like intrigue me to uh, like I need something to do with my life I can't just keep making videos and hope for the best I actually have to get out there and get a job and hold it so part of my problem with my jobs is I tend to either quit or I tend to lose interest and then quit. So, so right now I'm looking at either an express merit job, which is like a gas station job. It's very, it's like crappy pay and crappy work, but hey, it's a job. I gotta hold it. And the other one, the other one is a union, which my friend Michael tried to get me introduced into and I'm thinking about going with it it's uh it's called a uh, electrical union it's basically 
they I think they train somebody to be in the electrical field where you put in put uh, circuit boards or, or no circuit circuit boxes electrical units outlets you name it they do it anything electrical they train you for five years you put a down payment of $22 I think and then you get paid $14 for a year and then they upgrade your pay or kick you out depending on how well you're doing there's one night class yada 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 but it's just really interesting it's like electrical is just like legos you have instructions a little booklet more or less and you put pieces together it's really interesting i like it the problem is i i just forgot where the link was and i I gotta do more research on it before I make a final decision. So, to end this nerf update, it's it's kind of not really a nerf update. It's more like a big update. And let's see what else. I I have been trying to lose weight. I've been going to exercise. I've been doing exercise more frequently nowadays. Uh, I I'm starting from zero days a week to one days a week one day a week my bad maybe two days a week doing you know just strength training curls bench press deadlift whatever and besides I'm a six foot five guy and I need to lose weight or at least gain some muscle back and uh, let's see I have been eating healthier, however, I have been skipping breakfast about pretty much every day. Breakfast may be the be like the most important meal of the day, I don't know for sure. To me it's not, because it's just another another time for me to snack on food. And I'm trying to I'm trying to cut back as much as I can. It's hard, but I'm trying my best. So I think this concludes this big update. I hope you guys understood the video. I hope you guys know what's going on currently. So, uh, oh, one last thing I want to mention. Sorry to use up more of you guys' time, but my social life has been pretty, uh, eh. Like, I'm trying to ignore that. I'm trying to ignore the social life and focus on this, or electrical, or my life in general. But it's it's so tempting and so hard, and I I gotta like, push through that. So, without further ado, I'm gonna end the video now. I've talked for about a good 13 minutes. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, understood the video. Hope you guys know that I'm going through kind of a hard time, and why I haven't been making videos as often. This is probably like the one video I've made in a month or two, actually. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys later.